What's up my friends, welcome back to the channel. Today I believe will be a very short video because honestly I don't have a lot to say about the cocktail except that I believe it is an amazing one. I had the idea last week, tried it yesterday and I was like, whoa, that's good. I have to share that with my friends. So here we are today making a riff on the bourbon daisy using a homemade walnut orange syrup. If you guys are ready, let's make some cocktails. Okay, so quick recap on how I got the idea for today's cocktail. I was recently harvesting some walnuts on my friend's land, like there, literally out that door, and I was like, I have to do something with those nuts. So I had the idea of making an orange syrup with walnuts instead of almonds. I thought it was a great idea, but what to do with that syrup? That was the question. And then, literally the next day, an article popped on my computer about a riff on the bourbon daisy using orange syrup instead of grenadine. So that was it. The cocktail was born. As simple as that. A bourbon daisy with a homemade walnut orange syrup. It sounded great. I tried it and it was. So let's do it together for the ingredients. You're going to need bourbon, Cointreau, homemade walnut orange syrup, lemon juice, and one orange for the garnish. For the walnut syrup, I did the exact same thing that I would do for a regular orange syrup. I made some walnut milk, blended that with sugar, and added a little bit of orange blossom water. For the quantity, I used 200 ml of walnut milk with 300 ml of castor sugar and 5 ml of orange blossom water. Make sure your nuts are peeled, otherwise it will develop a lot of bitterness. I have a little trick for you if you want to make it yourself. It's going to be written in the description down below along with the full recipe. So now we're ready to make the cocktail. Let's build. In a cocktail shaker, we're going to pour one ounce and a half or 45 ml of bourbon. To that, we're gonna add half an ounce or 15 ml of Cointreau. Half an ounce or 15 ml of our walnut syrup. And three quarters of an ounce or 22.5 ml of freshly squeezed lemon juice. And now we're gonna fill our shaker with ice and give it a good shake for about 10 seconds. We're gonna fine strain it into a Nicanora. Or a cocktail coupe. And we're gonna garnish it with a large orange zest. First, we're gonna express it over the cocktail. Like that, gonna release some beautiful orange oils and aroma. I'm gonna make the zest pretty. If you wanna know how I made that zest, I've already made a tutorial about it. I'm gonna like it up here. And there we go. This is how we make the walnut bourbon daisy. Now, let's give it a try. I really like this one. It has everything I love about a cocktail. Straightforward, complex, and perfectly balanced. You get the bourbon out front with some beautiful orange flavors. You get the richness from the bourbon and the nut syrup as well. A hint of the orange blossom water at the back end. Everything plays really well in harmony. It is like a good old classic 
with just a little bit of funk. I think it is amazing. I love it and I hope you're gonna love it too. So that's it for me today, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if not already. Hit the like and the bell if you wanna be notified when we post a new cocktail video. Until then, thank you very much again. Have a great day and see you very soon. Cheers. Hmm. That's great. I love it. <sighs> now, like a child needs to put his toys back in his chest, I have to put my booze back in my chest. See you next week.